guys, welcome to day five of the January Pilates challenge. Today is another full body workout. So we're gonna start standing today. So just come up, standing up nice and slowly. We are just gonna step out. So we're gonna have one toe facing one corner of the room, one toe facing the other. So we're going to go into our plies. But just before we begin, we're gonna do some roll down. So you're gonna take your chin to your chest and roll your spine all the way down until you reach the floor. You can bend your knees if you need to, find a soft bend, and then come all the way back up to the top again. Good, coming down one vertebrae at a time. Inhale at the top. Exhale to come down through the spine. This should feel really quite nice for your spine. Feeling a nice massage and just really take your time. Make sure you drop your chin to your chest first. And the head is the very last thing to arrive when you roll back up. Good, really go through every single vertebrae. Good. That's it, we're gonna take one more like this, keeping your legs nice and wide. Good, from here you're just gonna bend both knees, keeping your hands on the floor if you can, and then stretch, good. Just feel a nice stretch here for your hip flexors and your hamstrings. Good, exhale as you lower, inhale to lift. Good job, just three. And two. Last one, we're gonna roll all the way up nice and slowly. The head is the last thing to arrive. Good, and we're gonna go into our plie. So from here, Take a deep inhale, and you're going to plie all the way down, taking your arms out in front of you, making sure your knees are in line with your toes. Good, that's it. Keeping your spine up nice and straight so you're not leaning forward, and up. Arms just in line with shoulders, no higher. And make sure you've got lots of tension through your fingertips. We wanna feel resistance through our whole body as we're doing this, good. That's it, so getting as deep as you can. Knees in line with the toes. Glutes are squeezed the whole time on the way up and on the way down. Try not to stop at the top. Notice that I'm just going up and down seamlessly. Good, and keep squeezing the whole time. Good job, guys. That's it. Exhale to come down. Inhale to come up. Squeezing your glutes for eight. Good. Seven, keep breathing. Core nice and tight. Six. Four, five. Last four, nice and slow, get as deep as you can. Three, final two. You're gonna hold at the bottom, we're gonna take tiny pulses here. Good, stay nice and low, keep your back up nice and straight if you can. Squeezing for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, keep squeezing, five, four, three, two, and one, standing all the way up. Good, this time we're gonna go down over the right foot, lifting up onto the ball of your foot, and stand. Left foot, good, really keep your heel nice and high. Exhale to lower, inhale to lift, good job. That's it. Really push the knee over the toe, get as deep as you can into that plie. Keep your chest nice and high. Good, squeezing your glutes. Four, eight, get nice and low. Seven, keep everything nice and aligned, resistance through the arms. Four, six, five, good, keep breathing. Four, last three. We are going to pull, so just mentally prepare for two. And one, coming all the way down, both heels on the floor, just hold. Stay low, stay in your box. Four, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, keep breathing, stay here, pulse the knees out, out, stay low, stay low, squeeze your glutes and your core. Four, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good, come all the way up. Stretch over your hamstrings, place your hands on the floor. Good job, just take a few breaths here. Rock your hips side to side if you need to. 
Good. That's it. And then slowly and carefully, you're going to come down onto your knees. Good job. From here, you are going to place your left hand on the floor with your right leg extended, making sure your left hand is directly underneath your shoulder. You're going to just place this right hand on your hip for now, and you are going to begin lifting and lowering that right leg. Good. It's not the most comfortable position at all. I promise I won't keep you here for long. We're going to be working our obliques and our glutes as well. Make sure you're pointing that toe nice and long and you're just lifting in line with the hip. Just squeeze the whole time. Don't let the leg go floppy. Control. Lifting for eight. Squeeze your core. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Four, three. Two. Last one, stay lifted, take the arm above your head, you're going to take the knee to elbow, use your obliques and extend, good, bring everything into the center, really nice, point the toes, keep everything strong, four, eight, seven, nearly done, four, six, good, four, five, almost here, four, three, last two, and you're going to come all the way down. You can kind of relax. Come all the way down onto your hands. Keep that leg lifted the whole time. Good. And we're going to go into our push-up. So make sure your hands are in line with your shoulders and you'll keep that leg long. <laughs> Take a deep inhale here. Exhale to lower yourself to the floor. Keep your elbows into your waist. Good. Exhale to lower. Squeeze your core nice and tight. Elbows into the waist. Good. Keep your head in line with your spine. Point those toes. Four, five. Four, four. Keep breathing. Three. And two. Last one. Good. Keep that leg lifted all the way. From here, you're going to take rainbows. Take it from one side to the other. But we're not taking the leg too high that the lower back starts expanding. Just tap the toes lightly. Good. Really nice. Keep squeezing those glutes, point the toes, and press away from your shoulders. Don't fall into the mat. Good. We want perfect posture here, guys. Really nice. Four, ten. And nine. Keep breathing. Eight. Keep squeezing those glutes. Seven. Four, six. Last five. Four. Three. Two more. Last one. Lift that leg all the way up. You're just going to take tiny pulses with that leg. Push yourself out of your shoulders. Just pulse the leg. Breathing here. Four, ten. Nine, eight, seven, keep that leg long, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good job. From here, you're going to come all the way down onto that forearm. Place the right hand on top. From here, we are going to take knee to elbow once more. Good. Squeeze in your obliques and use that core strength. Squeeze the glutes. Good. Your underneath glute is also going to be burning because it's stabilizing you. So stay nice and strong. Four, ten. Four, nine. Eight. Good. Seven. Six. Four, five. Four, four. Three. Last two. Hold that leg long. Last one. Hold here. Take tiny pulses, really small movement. Keep breathing. Four, ten. Nine. Eight. Squeeze your core. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Come all the way down. Good job. Open your knees wide. Drop all the way down to child's pose. Good job. That's it.
good. And from here, turn yourself all the way around. You're going to come into your abs. So coming all the way down onto your back. Scoop forward, grab hold of your thighs, and roll all the way down through your spine, one vertebrae at a time. Place your hands behind your head, good. And you are gonna bring your legs directly into a tabletop position, making sure your knees are in line with your hips, not over your stomach. From here, keep your head where it is. We're just gonna tap the toes on the floor, keeping the shape of the leg the exact same. So don't close the leg, good. Exhale to drop, inhale to lift, Exhale to drop, tap the toe, keep the shape of the leg the exact same. Really working your lower abdominals here. Good job. Exhale to drop and lift. Really feel your core working. Squeeze your abdominals as you lower that leg, hinging from the hip. Good. That's it. Just eight more like this before we add on. Seven. Six. Five, almost done. Four, three, two, last one from here. You're going to extend the leg long. Lower, lift, lower and tabletop. Extend long, lift, lower and tabletop. Good, just alternating legs each time. Keep those toes pointed. Exhale to lower. Really good job, guys. Keep breathing here. Just squeeze through everything. Get that core nice and tight, ready to lift your shoulders up. Off soon. Just five more like this. Four, four. Don't let that leg touch the floor. Four, three. Two. Last one. Good, from here, take both legs all the way up. From here, you're gonna go into your scissor. When you're ready, lift your chest and shoulders up off the mat. Keep your elbows nice and wide, scissoring the legs for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, come all the way down. Hug your knees into your chest, rock side to side if you need to. Good job, guys. From here, we're gonna go into our roll up. So, take your legs nice and long. We've done these before, so hopefully you're feeling quite practiced at them. Extend your arms over your head and point your toes nice and long. From here, you're gonna take a deep inhale, tuck your chin into your chest, squeeze your core, use your abdominals to lift yourself up and off the mat. Take yourself over, grab hold of your feet, and stretch. Inhale here, exhale to roll all the way down, nice and slowly, control the spine. The slower you move, the better. Inhale here, exhale, chin to chest. Squeeze all the way up. The slower you come up, the better. Squeeze yourself, stretch, stretch, stretch. Good. Exhale, come all the way back down as slow as possible. Control your body. Inhale. Exhale to lift your shoulders off the mat. Squeeze in your core. Good. Inhale here. Exhale as you lower all the way down. One vertebrae at a time. That's it. Really nice control. Last one coming all the way up. That's it. From here, you're going to grab hold of that right leg. Stretch it all the way up. Good, this time we're gonna open it up to the side a little bit. So we're stretching the inside of our leg now. So just open it up to the side, come back to center, place it all the way down, grabbing hold of the left leg. Peel the leg off the mat and open it to the side, back to center and all the way down. Good job. Stretch forward one last time. Good, and then slowly come all the way up. We're gonna go straight onto the other side of our kneeling position. So kneeling all the way up, you're gonna have your right hand on the floor this time and your left leg extended. Take that hand on that hip, good. From here, you're just gonna be lifting and lowering that leg. Make sure it's nice and long, your toes are pointed. Good, keep your core nice and tight, exactly. Really squeeze your obliques and those glutes with a nice long leg, good. Keep breathing here, you've got it. Nice and strong, squeezing everything. 
Exhale to lift. Inhale to lower. Good. Exactly. Four, ten. Nine. Eight. Just seven. Six. Five. Squeeze your core. Four. Three. Two. One, take that arm above your head, bring the elbow to knee, squeeze the obliques and extend everything out. Good, really nice, just eight like this, you've got it. Seven. Four, six. Exactly. Four, five. Last four. Four, three, remember to keep the leg lifted. Four, two. Last one, we're gonna go all the way around into that press up position, keep that leg lifted. Transition yourself smoothly, keep that toe pointed, elbows into the waist, inhale here, exhale to lower, let your nose touch the mat. Good, really nice guys. Keep your core nice and tight, breathing here. Good, four, five, four, four, Last three, keep that leg long. Two, last one. Hold that leg all the way up, take it into your rainbows. Tap the side and the other side, controlling the leg so the lower spine does not get involved. Good, exactly. Keep your hips square to the floor and press away from your shoulders the whole time. Good. Really feel those glutes working. Exactly. Four, ten. Four, nine. Four, eight. Almost done, guys. Seven. Last six. Keep everything squeezed. Nice and tight. Four, five. Four, four. Four, three. Almost done, four, two, four, one. Keep that leg lifted, take tiny pulses, really small. Good job. Keep squeezing all down the back of that leg. Four, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, coming all the way down to that right elbow. We're gonna bring knee to elbow one last time. Good, using your obliques, guys. Really squeeze the core, and it fully extend that leg. Make sure it reaches its full extension before you bring it in. Good, keep nice and steady on that right glute. Four, 10, almost finished. Nine, eight, seven, four, six, Four, five, last four, three, keep squeezing. Two, we're gonna pulse. Last one, take tiny pulses, four, ten. Nine, almost done. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, come all the way down, stretch out in front of you. We are gonna finish with a plank challenge, but just take a quick stretch. Take your hips to the sky, reach your arms forward. Good. From here, guys, coming up into your plank, you're gonna be pros at plank by the time this challenge is over. So, as always, you can be on your forearms or your hands. I'm gonna be on my hands, so just Choose your position and then join me here. So we're gonna be in our full plank position. We are going to take our knee to elbow. Again, that's the theme of the class apparently. <laughs> knee to elbow, keeping your hips low the whole time. That's the aim of this. I don't wanna see you coming in and out with your hips. Just that knee moves. Good. Keep your core tight and your head in line with your spine. Breathing here. Four, eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one.
on from here coming up into your down dog position good from here pushing all the way forward knee to chest really squeeze your knee all the way forward before you take it back inhale here exhale to pull forward touch your chin with your knee good you won't literally but just visualize that so that you really squeeze your core even more on the way in just eight then we're finished guys seven good four six last five squeeze tight last four four three good job two four one hold your plank position hold strong four ten nine eight seven six five four three two and one come all the way down guys into your child's pose take some breath here good and i'm relaxed you've done the hard work well done oh, really nice guys when you're ready roll all the way up and come seated in your front position we're going to take our stretch cross leg position from here you're going to interlace your fingers in the back of your body and take your arms up to shoulder height go then just let your body fall forward with your hands above your head good let your arms fall even higher that's it inhale to come all the way up that's it your left hand goes on the floor with your right arm reaching all the way over stretching through the side of your body and take it all the way to the other side that's it reaching all the way over breathing here and come all the way up good job guys that was another tough one that was day five so i will see you on day six well done